kind of hurts us here. Long story short, the URLs are encoded. There is actually an encoding process it's called like URL encoding or URL decoding. You may have seen this if you're in like JavaScript or something. You have um, URL or encode URI and encode URI components. So if I were to say foo space bar, we will get that percent 20. Uh, there's something kind of magical about that. The percent is actually just the number that follows percent is the ASCII representation of the character that's there. So long story short, we need to URL decode this data because it might have some data that we don't want. So I'll make an example. Let's vim foo space bar dot text. Hello, my file name has spaces in it. There we go. So foobar dot text has spaces in it. If we go over to the bash web server and we try to curl that, how do we curl it? Localhost 8080 foobar dot text. This will yell at us. That didn't work. So we have to encode it. How do we encode it? Percent 20 and we don't get anything back. That's because it tried to find a file with a literal percent 20 in there. So we have to decode the URI component. This is gonna get really cool. I'm gonna show you guys something awesome. 